Good day, hockey fans. Grady Wittenberg with you from the Veterans Memorial Arena here in downtown Binghamton. It's a battle for first place shaping up here tonight. A 7.05 face-off between your first place Binghamton Senators and the Wilkes-Barre Scranton Penguins. Binghamton coming in on a little bit of a slide. They've lost their last two, including a 5-4 overtime setback Saturday in Ottawa at Canadian Tire Center against the Hamilton Bulldogs. The Sens getting off to a great start in period number one. Shane Prince opening the scoring with a breakaway goal, and then it was the team's leading goal scorer and point producer, Mike Hoffman, adding a pair to end up with a 3-0 lead for the Senators, but they couldn't hang on to that advantage. As the Bulldogs came storming back, they scored five of the final six goals, including Jared Tenorti's game-winning goal with under a minute to go in the overtime period. With the loss and Wilkes-Barre's overtime loss in Hershey on Sunday, now just a one-point gap between the top two teams in the East Division. Binghamton was 62, the Penguins was 61, as these teams meet for a fourth time in what will be an eight-game regular season series. The Penguins so far winning two of the first three, and it's been a home series so far. Binghamton's only victory coming back on October 25th here at the arena in a 4-3 shootout decision over the visiting Penguins. Since then, Binghamton losing two in a row down at Mohegan Sun Arena at Casey Plaza. Tom Kostopoulos, the veteran forward and captain of this current edition of the Wilkes-Barre Scranton Penguins, leading them in goal scoring with 18, and he tops their point charts with 32. Jeff Delorier, early in the season, the number one goaltender for head coach John Hines, but nine of the last 11 games, it's been Eric Hartzell with the start, and with that, he has led the Penguins to within one point of the East Division lead. It's the Penguins and the Senators coming up tonight. Good seats still remain. Call 722-SEND, 722-7367 right now for tickets. It's Power to the Purple Night in memory of Darren Richardson and uh, the Mental Health Association of the Southern Tier sponsoring tonight's game. Wear purple, support the cause. This is what I'll have on tonight as I call the game. And bring your radios. You can catch my game night call on Oldies 96.9 and 680 WINR. For Game Day with Grady, I'm Grady Wittenberg. Enjoy tonight's contest.